Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Salesforce Hunt. This is Rohit and today I'm going to show you how to create your own custom icon for the custom tab. And uh, it is very good features and uh, you can watch this video until end if you want to learn something new and please subscribe the channel for more updates. Please turn on the bell icon for more updates so you never be miss any kind of update from my side. So let's get started. So first of all you have to log in to your Salesforce or so I just logged in into my Salesforce org. So you can see this is the Salesforce org. And uh, how to create the tab, you know very well. So suppose that I want to create some, you know, like custom object. And that time I want to select, you know, like one option that is called create custom tab at the time of object creation. So that, that things we will see here. Okay, so just under here, you have to search like object, right? Here you can see like lots of objects and everything you can see here. Just click on this, under the create segment, you can see like object. So just click on this object, create new custom object. Let's say student for example purpose. So I'm creating this one, uh, students, something like that. You can create any object as you want. So for your better understanding purpose, so that's why I'm showing this teacher and students like that. Okay, so you can give any name here and this is the option. Please observe, this is the option launch new custom tab wizard after saving the custom object, right? So at the time of object creation, we can create the tab. After created the tab, you can, after creating the object, uh, you can also create the tab. That is the functionality also provided by the Salesforce. So don't worry about it. So first of all, you can see here, this one, uh, I didn't select here anything right now. So just click on this save button. So now you can see my custom object is created successfully here. So how to create the tab? Just under the quick find you have to search like tab. And before that you have to do one thing or you, this is of some prerequisite. You have to uh, create your own icon. You can create any icon or you can uh, search in Google as well. Okay, doesn't matter. So just under the custom object tab, you can select new button. Just click on this new button here. Under the new, you can see like object. So I want to select this student object and this is the tab style. So you can create your tab style as well. Custom tab style. Once you click on this magnifier glass, you can see this is the tab style selector. So Salesforce already provide lots of, you know, like standard uh, tab style here. You can see uh, you can create your own as well. So here you can see this option. If you want to create your own custom style, you can select this uh, button and you can click on this button and you can create your custom uh, tab style okay so if you are not satisfied on these all you know predefined you know templates or styles so you can create your own as well so this is the branding purpose so you can easily identify right so just click on this create your own style under here you can select any color this is the color palette so once you click on this one it's showing like rgb color here so you can select any color as you want here like this okay and let me select any color randomly let's say this one and it's asking like icon so once you click on this insert an icon so just click on this insert an image and you have to upload your image uh, only file 20 kb or smaller or so so you have to consider that our file icon should be less than 20 kb okay so now you can see the here so how to create this my document and something like that like my personal document so you can just go ahead here in the Salesforce, we have, you know, like documents in the old tabs. So you have to search like document here. So you can see the document, like documents, just click on this documents and create new document and give any name as you want. Let's say custom icon for tab. Okay. And available for external image available, like uh, externally available image and choose your file so i already downloaded some file so you can see my file like Wing png so you have to select this file and click on this save button so once you save it now you can see our uh, file size is 15 kb that is correct less than 20 kb and also my image here my icon image here right so once you upload it now you have to do one thing again just click on this setup button here and search tab again like tab under the tabs, just click on these tabs here, create new one, select the object, click on this magnifier glass, create your own style, 
choose any color as you want. Let's say I want to select this color, insert an image. So you can see like custom icon for the tab. I already uploaded that icon here. So you can see this one. So select it. Immediately you please observe here. My icon showing here. Right. So this is the for custom, you know, custom tab icon. So you can create like that. Any image as you want. So for now I'm using this penguin here. So just click on this insert image. So once you click on this insert image and click on this OK. Immediately you can see my tab style like custom style. And this is the, my penguin, you know, like icon. Click on the next. And you can give any profile as you want. For the timing, I'm using everything as I selected. So just click on the save button. Once you save it, immediately you can see my custom tab. So in this custom object tabs, under the custom object tabs, like a student and teacher. So how to show this one? Very simple. Just you can click on this student tab. And immediately in the home screen also, you can see my custom icon. And this one, this is right. This is the penguin here. So just create new one also. And let's say like demo, create save. Immediately you can see my record as well um, with my custom icon also showing here. And in this recently item here, right? So this is how to create your custom icon. And for the custom tabs, you can use it anywhere as you want in your Salesforce org. And this is the best practice to always follow, you know, like uh, for, you know, branding purpose or, you know, specify for the object recognition, record recognition. You can easily identify your records with custom icon. Uh, you can easily identify your custom object as well. So guys, I hope you learned something new in this video. If you feel like this is a very more informative for us, so please subscribe the channel and please hit the bell icon for more updates. So you never miss any kind of update from my side. So till then, bye-bye, take care. See ya. Thank you for watching, guys.